here we are again, Paco on, on uh, another hunt. Uh, this is going to be attached to the uh, the beach one that I was at because that got cut a bit short. So uh, we'll uh, we'll attach it to this one. Uh, there's Pete, Terry, and Steve over there. Just all setting up, getting ready. Let us see. It's a beautiful day, and uh, we're going to be detecting all round here. All round here, all down there. So these are the settings. We're going to use that GM power setting again. I've ground balanced it already. Should be able to see that. So this is five. Sensitivity 90, I'd knock that up to 92. Frequency 4 kilohertz. <clears throat> Iron volume is 3. Uh, reactivity is 2. Expert 0. So it's off, that silencer. Audio is 5. Expert is overload 1. And that's it. So we'll see how we get on today. Hopefully we might get a few silver coins if we're lucky. Right, I'll see you at the first hole. Right, at the first one. We're not getting any numbers whatsoever there. Sounds a bit iffy. And it says it's quite deep. So we'll give that a dig. I'll get that up and I'll show you in a minute. Right, we've turned over that clod, and now listen to it. Forty-one, thirty-seven. Forty-one to thirty-seven. That one. So that could be something interesting. Basketball has been fired. Yep, exactly what that is. Like a pistol ball. Very small. Got some flat on that end. So that's a good start. That says there's some age here, so that's good. Right, on to the next. Right, here we are back at the next one. Strange sound this one. It's like it can't get a distinct There's something there but you don't know what so very faint. Give this a dig and see what it is. Alright, pack it the next one. We didn't dig that last one, it was a bit of rubbish. So I didn't bother filming it. We've got 72. 74, 76. Pinpoint it. in a second. Right, I've got that one over. Still in the hole. So let's have a look what this can be. Oh, 
this. Well, I think that's another pistol ball that's been mullered. It's giving our readings, huh? I don't know what that is. Not sure it looks coppery. Oh. Yeah, not too sure. Okay, on to the next. Alright, oh, back at the next one. We're under a tree here. Yeah? Well, a few trees. 82. 79, 82. It's not very deep, so I can nearly get it with a probe. Uh, I'll just see if we can do this the light bit to turn some of this mulch over. Let's see if we can find it. Oh, should be able to get it. Second, let's try and put my glove on. Right, right it's down there somewhere. Let's hope it's our first coin of the day. In there. Oh, I don't think I went deep enough. Alright, oh, just dig that over with a spade. Alright, oh. oh, I thought I just saw it. I think it's another musket ball. No, I was wrong. Oh. Well, that's unusual. And why has that not told me that's iron then? Oh, right, I'll have to go through my settings again. Right, bit of rubbish. That's the same girl here. No. That was it. Oh. There's Tez over there. What you got, Tez? Hi. What you found? Oh, right. How are you getting on? Yeah, I found a couple of pistol balls, and that's about it. Last night, Chris. Yeah, lovely, lovely. <coughs> right. On to the next, I'll just check out my uh, detector and uh, see why that's not picking that up. We'll put that down there and put some, do some tests on that. Right, on to the next. All right, back again. <coughs> Dug a couple of 2-2 uh, two -two bullet shells, which are rubbish. Uh, hold on, I have to move my spade. <coughs> just down here. Doesn't sound too healthy. No, uh, 82, that's showing up in the iron. As you can hear, I've gone over to full tones just to uh, distinguish this iron. So I'll leave that. Uh, let's just try it in dose fast. In tracking, see that don't like it. Right, <clears throat> I don't like that. Right, I won't dig that. So we're on to the next. Right, 
Here we are, back again. Look. Got a nice 55, 56. Skin four nuts. Right there. I don't think that's too deep at all, that. Let's have, let's have a check. Could be another bullet shell. Turnover. After lunch, I think I'll just bring my knife out. It can make it a lot easier digging. Let's get that little bit up. That could be a 2 2 shell, that. Just a bit of rubbish, a bit of aluminium. Alright, that was a bad look. Literally a load of rubbish. Alright, on to the next. Right, I've got a nice little signal here. It's showing really deep, so I'll put the camera on the stand for now. So, uh, we'll dig it up and see what it is. numbers on the screen. Let's hope it's a nice deep silver coin. Let's take that out. Let's give that a check. Hmm. Very strange. This is a bit of iron. That's all it is. Hot lock. Alright, on to the next. Alright, here we are back again. There's Pete over there, digging an owl. I've got a signal here. Got that up. Sixty-seven. It sounds very, very scratchy. This one. I don't know what that, that means. Well, it probably means it's rubbish.
Come on in, where are you? I think it's a bit of junk. Yep. Just another little bit of rubbish. Right, never mind. On to the next. Right, here we are back again. We've gone in to back into the GM program. I'm getting a broken. was a 50 before that sounds quite deep that a bit broken but we'll give it a dig see what it comes up right that all that was was that bit of rubbish that's all it was all right we'll see you in the next one all right back at the next and um, we're getting no numbers showing quite deep. We flashed up 76. So I'll pinpoint this. About there. So I'll give that a dig up and I'll get back to you. Right, got that one up, and now listen to this. 88, 80, oh, 81, 82. That's cleaned up really well. So, give this a pro. Hopefully, it could be our first coin today. There's some wet. Yeah, I thought that was a coin sticking out. I think it's just a bit of rubbish. Let me just see. Let's wipe it off. Yep, I think all that is a bent up bit of. I don't know. Uh, could be copper. I don't know, we'll have to have a look and untwist it later. But it, I thought that was a coin when I saw that thin edge in. Like that. Never mind, on to the next. Alright, back in after that bit of rubbish. 74. 75, 73. Right beside this tree. Better dig up. Let's give this a large dig, see what this one comes out at. I like things near trees, they normally tend to be quite good. Deeper. Alright, bear with me one sec and I'll put you on in a second. Right, I found what it is. There it is there. It's a 
bit of rubbish. There's another bit of it there. I can't get it out because it's stuck in the tree. All right, so it's just a metal spike or something like that. All right, on to the next. All right, here we are, the next one. I just had a com com uh, conversation with uh, Terry and Pete and Steve and uh, I haven't found much. This musket ball, stuff like no coins, but this could be the first one. 87, that's giving a pound coin reading. It's right by that gate. Right. So, we'll give that a dig up. Right there. Let's see if we can do this one live here. Might as well. Something hard oh, there, so I hope it's in this clod. Let's just check it. That's still down there. Oh, that could be a bit of bloody iron or steel. doing this one-handed. Turn that off. That doesn't look good. Look at that. How deep was that? Six inches? Bleeding bottle top. What a load of rubbish. Went very good today here. Fry cove. I don't know what that is. Right, on to the next. Alright, I've got one here. Turned it over. Let's come for 77 now. Started off at 62. 75. Let's just pinpoint this because I can't, can't find it. Right there. Alright, I'm going to have to dig this a bit deeper. Hopefully we'll get it. It's still in there. Christ, that is bleeding deep then. Just, I'll get back to you in one sec. Alright, we've got that one up. That turned out about so six inches. I was a bit off there. It's just a bit of shaped lead. Could have been an old spindle work one time. Don't know. Don't know. It's definitely lead though. There's no markings on it. Right, so that's one of the best bits we've found so far. Which is not very good. Right, on to the next one. Right, I've got to show you this. I just dug a washer from over there next to this tree. 77. Right in where that tree is. Right, let's see if we can get this. Uh, look. That's a bit of rubbish. 
just a bit of can. Right. Never mind. On to the next. Right, back after lunch. I uh, just bought me knife at this time. We've got a little 44 signal here. Just down there. So, uh, got my new knife. <coughs> uh, 35 bucks. Huh? Nice and strong. Bought it from Detechnics. Near Fontwell. Good knife. So, Let's have a look. Yeah. I said it was four when it is. A chunky four, that's all that is. Right, on to the next. Right, here we are on the next one. Just a sip about a second later. 85. Right there. Let's give this a dig up. Right there about. Sort of rubbish. Yeah, a bit of rubbish. Yeah, <coughs> it's quite trashy this ground, so just gonna have to bear bear with it. And hopefully, amongst it all, we might pull out some coins. All right, on to the next one. All right, back again. Just dug that hole there. And, uh, it's been a long time since I've picked, got anything. I've found some lead. It's got that 1961 penny. Yeah, that was a, a bugger to get. It's over to the side. It wouldn't pinpoint right. All right. I'll check the hole and uh, see if there's anything in there. Seems to be it. Right. I'll see you at the next. Right, back again. We've got 51 here. Look, give this a dig. See what turns up. This ground is semi hard here. Somewhere. Oh, that's the first one I ever found there, an old bullet casing. I thought it was going to be something good, that. Never mind. There's Pete still down there. I think we're the only two left now. I think the other two have gone home. So uh, if we carry on, I'm going to make my way up this path here. 
and uh, see what we come across. Hopefully some more coins. Alright, on to the next. Alright, back again. Not very far, about another 10 foot. Jumping about a bit, 68, 72. It's pinpoint it. Coming up quite deep, but let's see. The sun's around there somewhere. Let's check it. Just in case it was messing about. Let's have a look with that. Not it surely. Looks like a bit of a. I don't know. No, what well, is bloody heavy? Might be a bit of iron. Let me just check that. Hold on. Yeah, that was it. So that bit of crappy steel or iron or something. Might give a signal. Okay. Never mind, that's all it is. On to the next. Right, back again. About another 10 foot away from that one. It's a bit of coin. Oops, not there. Give this one a dig. Hopefully it should be a coin. Going on here, and I've just lost it. Ah, oh, here we go. No, oh, it's a bloody shotgun cartridge. How do you bring it up an 80 odd? It's been an old one, old type. Yeah. That's all it is. Right, what's the next? Right, here we go, that's the next one. <coughs> Bit of a choppy. 69. Just that. Seven inches. 
<clears throat> if that's correct, six inches. You ought to do that and it'll be on the bloody top now. Yeah, somewhere. Let's see if we can dig this one live. Put this in the other end. God, oh, it's a bit hard there. Oops. Hopefully it's something nice. Let's have a look. Are oh, you kidding me? What's that? Oh, another bloody shotgun thing. 69 that was reading that bloody thing. Right, never mind. <laughs> On to the next. Right, back again, very shortly as well. 52. It's not sounding. A bit of a twang to this one. <coughs> uh, it's a very large. And it's crap. Bloody iron ring, isn't it? Yep. Yeah. Some sort of ring. I don't know whether it's copper. No, I don't know. Rubbish. That's what was giving that twangy sound. That's it, big ring. <coughs> All right. Well, there's a lot of rust there, so it's probably uh, iron. Right, I'm going to do along this carry on up here. And it's, it's beautiful here. There's a big old tree there, look at that one. Oh, mate, that's huge. So we'll have a scout around there and see what we get. Right, not many more, and uh, I'll have to uh, do a round up, be a bit of a poor show. Only found a penny and two, one old penny and one new penny, and a few bits of. Uh, lead and stuff not very much but that's it i'll see you at the next one